here you are watching is the viscosity setup by using this setup we are going to determine the viscosity of a liquid that is water by poissonist method the apparatus required for this explosion is water burette burette stand rubber tube capillary tube a stop clock and then a meter scale the burette is fixed in the burette stand here using a rubber tube both burette and then capillary tube which are connected the capillary tube is kept horizontal by using a table by using water the burette is filled with water above zero level the burette opener is first open and then if the water level if it reaches zero if the lower viscous of water and it reaches zero at that instant the stop clock also switched on for each five ml we have to note down the time taken and then these readings which are tabulated in the tabulation up to 50 ml we have to note down these readings in the tabulation here an important note the stop clock it should not be disturbed till the water level it reaches 50 and the liquid flow also should not be disturbed till it reaches 5 for the first flow of 5 ml of liquid from 0th level to 5th level 0th level of height from the table that is called as h1 and then 5th level of height from the table is called h2 for the first flow of 5 ml of liquid 0th level of height that is called as h1 from the table and then 5th level of height from the table is called h2 in this manner the respective heights of each five ml of flow of liquid that is tabulated in the tabulation a capillary tube of diameter also is noted that it is observed by using a traveling microscope the capillary tube of inner radius should be fine by using a traveling microscope for more accuracy of finding the capillary tube of diameter by using traveling microscope we have to measure two diameters by using two cross wires one is vertical cross wire and another one is by using horizontal cross wire here we are going to determine the diameter of capillary tube in horizontal direction as well as in the vertical direction by adjusting the vertical and horizontal screws the vertical horizontal wire that is fixed in the left circumference of the inner bore adjusting the vertical and the horizontal screw of
Ravana microscope, the vertical cross wire the red is fixed in the left side circumference of the inner bore of capillary tube. For that, we have to note down the readings in the horizontal scale. By adjusting the horizontal screw of tiny microscope, the vertical cross wire that is fixed in the right side of the circumference of the inner bore of capillary tube. For that, also we have to note down the readings in the horizontal scale of traveling microscope. Similarly, similarly, by adjusting the vertical screw of traveling microscope, the horizontal wire is fixed in the upper circumference of the capillary board. For that, we have to note down the readings in the vertical scale. By adjusting the vertical screw of trolley microscope, the cross wire, that means the horizontal cross wire, that is fixed in the bottom of the circumference of the capillary tube. For that also, we have to note down the readings in the vertical scale. And all the readings of trolley microscope, that is tabulated in the tabulation. The coefficient of viscosity is determined by using the formula eta is equal to pi rho g r power 4 ht divided by h l v. Here pi is constant and rho the density of water, g also a constant and r the radius of the capillary tube. HT can be obtained by using the tabulation tool. L, the length of the capillary tube, and V, the volume of the liquid, 5 into 10 power minus 6 meter cube.